I don't even know if you can see me. Uh, but uh, if by some chance you can, let me see. Let me see. Oh, you sort of kind of can. You sort of kind of can. Uh, maybe I should also take off my hoodie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm headed to Struben Dam uh, Sanctuary. Struben Dam Bird Sanctuary right now. Uh, I was just showing you guys. What does this form part of? Is this Twilight? I'm not sure. But yeah, the sun rise. The sun has is yet to rise. The sun is yet to rise. I will probably actually need my phone just now. Um, turns out that because of roadworks around Menlin, um, that road that they were busy constructing, uh, the turn off to where I'm going has been cut off. Now I have to use a route I'm not familiar with. But um, I think I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I think I'll be okay. Roadworks are affecting my time, yo. To some point, to some degree. I think if I turn by these traffic lights, I should be okay. This road, by the way, takes you to like just maybe two k down the road is uh, Ferret Glen Nature Reserve, and I'm not necessarily looking to go to Ferret Glen Nature Reserve. Um, yeah. How about? The thing that I like about Pretoria is that a nature park is always not too far away. Not too far away. This is Truven Dam by the way. Can you see the... Hey, what's up? This could make a... An interesting wide angle for the sunrise, but I still venture on. Should have brought gloves. Somewhere, somehow, my cable release is stuck on one end. Don't know if it's broken or what.
so the sun is just about to pop out in fact you can even say in some areas it already it has already popped up so this is my setup I'm shooting the Bronica I'm shooting it on the 50 millimeter which is roughly an equivalent of um, 28 millimeter I love this lens you'll see just now that the one that I shot before was uh, was this one which is the, the standard 80 mil I also have a what is this 250 I don't know what's going on here but it's it seems like it needs to be higher I don't know how did it just get like that technology or mechanics in this case well it's mechanics is part of technology so I've taken two shots so far I just switched to this guy right now to shoot you see that bit there this bit here with yeah, with those trees in the background the two trees that's the shot that I got with this guy the only problem the problem I generally have with this 250 is that most cases I never really know if it's in focus or not. But anyway, these are the colors that I came for. I mean, I do have, I have accepted that winter really, I mean look at the trees now, it's just like glowing. Winter doesn't really have the best skies, winter sucks in terms of that regard. Um, because I truly believe that um, clouds make the best sun rises and sunsets. It's just that here, look, it still works. It's still look, it's still great to be out in nature at this time. But my reservations still stand. Winter does not have the best skies. Oh yeah, I think for now I think for now I'm about to now go move off to another spot to go you know find more shots to shoot. I've got I've taken about three pictures so far. I'm left with nine. Mm, yes, out of this medium format you only get twelve pictures, six by six. And um yeah, I think I'm gonna try and find more varied things to shoot. But this, I'm, like, I haven't come out in the morning in a long time. I mean, I'm happy for this. of you see that glow right there with those trees sticking out I've already taken a picture of these two guys down here Some, somehow the, the struggle to straighten this guy out is like I don't know man mission oh gosh it's cold <sighs> my arm my my fingers are frozen right now this is what happens when you just step out into into winter without yeah, I mean, 
all along I've been indoors, you know, for the longest time. So I haven't had a clue of how cold it gets out here. I don't, I don't even think I'm in the shot properly. I'm about to venture into there somewhere. Oof. There's a bunch of trees I saw the last time I was here that fascinated me enough to the point of wanting a picture of them. I hope they work out. Whoa! Did I mention that my fingers are frozen? So this is my next shot. From here. Let me see. Let me see. I might shoot this with the 80. So I'm going to use this branch here as well as this one here as like some sort of a frame into the shot where there's a path that goes to those trees there. I really like them. For now I've just been waiting for the light to properly fall down into them. Oh, as the sky, as the sun rises up. It keeps illuminating more of the ground. I think this is perfect. For my next shot, actually I took two by the way here. I mean, for my next one, will I manage? I should be able to jump there. So, after trying to find another shot, I'm hungry. I have not ventured to the side of this place. I don't know where it leads, but hey, this is part of the explorations.
Wald. Busy. Like there's lots of trees, lots of bush basically. Pretty cluttered. And that road kinda just that path just fades away on its own. Let's see where this goes. I'm from. This is what I've landed up across. Where the sun is basically. I like that green here. But I'm gonna shoot this. This is my next shot. Probably the last picture. Obviously always on the bridges there's some stuff. I just met some of the guys. I think they patrol this park. I think the jackets are written security. This is how you have to walk around. I just politely greeted. I'm going back now. I think I'll have a shot left. This is one shot. I'll find something for it. The sun is like pre pretty proper, properly out now. So I tried to cross there and it didn't really work out. It didn't work out. Um, I've just decided that this is how I'm gonna finish my last shot. It kinda fulfills the stuff that I like, you know, pathways. I don't know why. But I like pathways. Someone said it's because I have a spirit of adventure and paths tend to lead to adventure. So this is how I'm gonna finish this. By the way, I am shooting on if I haven't I mean you you saw the start of the video. Uh but yeah, I am shooting what's it called? Fuji Pro 160NS that expired in December 2018 so it's still fairly relevant it's still fairly alright I believe I think I hope but yeah basically this is the first time I use it we will see how it turns out I forgot to pretty much say goodbye I'm pretty much done with the shoot now. <sighs> Taking the long route to go back to my car just to get steps on my watch. You know, to say I did something today. I did an exercise. I walked around with the camera and stuff. Yeah, so, but I think I've just realized that I think there's something wrong with my mic connectivity something is going on there it's making a sound i'm actually the houses here the houses that are next to the park are pretty cool looking obviously um uh, yeah so thank you for watching this and yeah see you on the next one <laughs>